Hello friends and welcome to Coffee and Conversation. Encouragement for today. Rays of Hope from the Gordon Avenue Baptist Church in Adel, Georgia. Friend, let me invite you to get a good fresh cup of hot coffee. Sit with me for just a minute. Let's have an encounter with God and His precious Word on this beautiful day. Well, amen. What better way to start a brand new day than fresh coffee and getting into the truth of God's precious Word? Take your Bible today and turn with me, if you will, over to the book of Hebrews, Hebrews chapter number 13, and today I want us to look at verse 15 as our text verse of Scripture. Now the Bible says here, By Him, therefore let us offer the sacrifice of praise to God continually, that is the fruit of of our lips giving thanks to His name. One of the most important things that you and I can do is give thanks to God in that wonderful name, Jesus. Today, friend, I want to bring to you a devotional thought that is titled, Joy in Sharing. You know, Jesus knew that one of the real tests of our yielding to God is our willingness to share with others. If we have no mercy toward others, that is one proof that we never experience God's mercy ourselves. A fellow by the name of Emerson must have been reading the gauge of human mercy when he said this statement. What you are speaks so loud that I cannot hear what you say. Satan does not care how much you theorize about Christianity or how much you profess to know Christ. What he opposes vigorously is the way you live Christ. Remember, I've said it before and I'll say it again, your actions always speak louder than words. Some time ago, a lady wrote and said, I'm 65 years old. My children are all married. My husband is deceased. And I am one of the loneliest people in all the world. It was suggested to her that she find a way of sharing her religious faith and her material goods with those around her. She wrote a few weeks later and said, I am the happiest woman in town. Friend, it is vitally important that we have joy in sharing Jesus with others. Will you do that? Think about it. Pray with me. Father, we thank you for this beautiful devotion that gives us the responsibility or lets us know our responsibility in sharing the gospel message with others. Help us do it, that Jesus may be glorified. For it's in His name I pray. Amen. Well, God bless you today, my friend. I pray you have a wonderful day in Christ. And let others see Christ in you and share Him with the world. It'll make your world a better place to live in.